Yeah. Hi everyone. Well, I want to talk about the war in Ukraine at the moment. And one of the main battle rifles that is being used. And that would be the SKS. The SKS is the one of the main civilian battle rifles being used at the moment. It's not the only civilian battle rifle. They have AK-47s, but this is being given to civilians. And the SKS is more than capable of doing everything the AK is, if not more, um, is, in my opinion, more accurate than the AK. Um, so, yeah. Uh, now, they're not using this particular model of SKS. This one is a Chinese Type 56. So, they're not using this one. They're probably using Russians. I don't know if the Ukrainians had their own form of SKS, but they are really, really good guns. They are very, very nice shooters. Um, but this just proves the fact of the Second Amendment and the idealism, the idealism that a country cannot stand up to someone with more firepower. Yes, they might fail, but the Ukrainians are still fighting. Even using this rifle, or the AK-47, or the um, other rifles that they have in their armament, they're nowhere compared to the AK-101s or the AK-103s that the Russians are using. The AK-101s are brand new rifles. These guns have been made since a little bit after World War II. Uh, I mean, they are somewhat a copy of the SVT. Um, they're a carbine version of the SVT, kind of. But they are good rifles. They are a little bit heavier than the, the um, AK-47. But they're still good guns. And we can see the Ukrainians just knocking the heck out of the Russians using whatever they have. I mean, you hear some of the stories where the Ukrainians say, I'll use a fire knife to kill these guys. So, the Ukrainians are not going down without a fight. And, I mean, I wouldn't either. And, if I had this gun with me, I mean, I would feel more than powered to take on a, a, the Russians because this is really a good rifle. It really is. For all the crap that people give this rifle, it is a good rifle. Thank you, YouTube. Have a good day.